Hello and welcome everyone. Today we're going to be learning how to build your first house. So let's just jump right into it here. So we're going to need to cut down some trees. We need to cut down some trees. So you need to find yourself an axe or a chainsaw. Doesn't matter if it's a fire axe. That works fine as well. So let's get these trees cut down. What we got? We got some sticks. And you should also get some logs from these trees. Alrighty, so let's cut one or two more down. Alright, there we go. Looks like my inventory is full. So, let's run up this hill, and I kind of like this. I kind of like this view here. There's a town behind us, so... I think it's a pretty good location right here to uh, build our little house. So, you press tab to open up your inventory, and we're going to have to go to the crafting menu down here. So just click on that, and then we can drag these logs over. We're going to need some boards. So, we're gonna first thing we're going to do is build the foundation. So, let's create all these boards here. You can hold control and click to craft all. So, that's pretty useful. So, we're just going to create all these here. Uh, I'm going to save a few though, save a few though, because we might need some boards later. But, you create the boards from the logs, and then you create the uh, wooden frames from the wooden plates. So, let's do that. And now we have frames turned to foundations. So, let's craft two foundations. Alrighty, so we've had our foundations now. We know how to build those. Let's put them down. So, to put them down, we need to equip them here. So... Whatever button you like, or you can always just select and hit the equip button there, and I'll put straight into your hand. So let's equip these, and you should see a green square where it's going to be placed. Let's let's get somewhere quite nice. Let's how about here? Here's looking all right, about on the top of the hill here. So let's hold left mouse to put that down. Alrighty, so we have our first foundation. Our first foundation. Good stuff, guys. So now what we're going to do? We're going to learn how to place foundations next to each other. So. What we don't want to be doing is trying to line up all our foundations like this perfectly because that just is not going to happen. So what we need to be doing is be looking out the other foundation you just placed just around this area here and it should line up directly where you want it if you want it next to this foundation. On all corners it will do this, um, all the building blocks do do this as well so make sure you keep an eye out, eye out on that. So we're going to aim it up here, hold click and place our second foundation. So, it's looking pretty good right now. I'm thinking I'm thinking we need some sort of campfire now, guys. A bit of light, a bit of light. We can also craft with the campfire. So, for that, we're going to need some stones. So, we, we can get them from these rocks around here, guys. There's one here. There's I believe there's one over the mountain over there, just over there. But we're going to we're going to mine this one up. So, let's get our pick out and just get to mining this. This should drop drop rocks and stones. A rock, I believe, is... Let's have a look. Yep, rocks are three stones. So let's pick up the stones there. A rock, sorry. And here. Good stuff. Alrighty. And when they're mined, they'll have all these grey lines over them. So let's make this campfire. And for the campfire, we're going to be needing these stones here and some sticks, I believe. So let's get that done. Stones and sticks. It is four stones and four sticks, but... uh. We have enough there, so let's craft that campfire and then take those sticks and stones back out. Alrighty. So again, to put this down, you're going to see the green area where it's going to land and just whack that down there. Good stuff. Good stuff. But a house is a bit exposed right now. A bit exposed. So we're going to need going to need quite a few pillars and some walls. To put a wall up, you do need a two pillars on the corners here. So let's build those pillars. For the pillars, I recall, we need some of the wooden support. So to get those, you just craft them from sticks. So let's craft all of those. And we need some boards. So we have the boards which we recently crafted from the logs. So put those in there and we should get some pillars. Alrighty, so we have our pillars now. We have five of them. We only need four, but uh, we will be needing some more later. So let's put these on every single corner here. Two, three, and number four. Alrighty then, so we're off to a great start guys. We've got our campfire, our pillars, and now we just need some walls, roof, and maybe a doorway and a door. So the next step is, let's just pick up these supports there. And the next step is to build some more uh, walls here. So for a wall, 
Let me just have a quick check what we need for that. We need two frames and a pillar. So we're going to be needing a quite a few more pillars. So let's craft these sticks. And then craft those and some boards to get more pillars. All right. So we have five pillars there. I do not think that's enough, but we're out of sticks, guys. We're out of sticks. But luckily, if you have a handsaw, we can throw that up in the tool section there. You can use boards. So let's cut these boards up into some more sticks. So I'm just going to control click there to cut all those up. And from those sticks, we can make more supports. Let's make all these supports. And we'll use those last two sticks as well. Just throw them on in there. Alrighty, so we have 18 more supports here. We can make quite a few more pillars. Um, I'm aware it is two pillars, I believe, per wall. So we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight for the door frame as well. So we need at least eight pillars here. Whack that in there. So we need five, we need three more pillars. One, two, three. Alrighty. So now we need to make these walls. So to make a wall, it is the pillars we've just made and a wooden frame. And that should give us some walls. So one, two, three. But we ran out of pillars here. So let's craft some more of those. The frame, sorry, we ran out of frames. So let's craft some more of those. So we need to craft the logs, the boards here into the plates and the plates into the frames that we need. Throw them in there. And those with the pillars here should be at to correct four walls. Alrighty, so we have our four walls now. Before I place those down, I'm going to show you guys how to make a door frame. To make a door frame, we need to put the wall in here, but we also need two supports. So let's put this, we'll just put the whack the 12 in there, and you should see it'll take two out. Let's craft that. So what are we sitting on now? We're sitting on, we have the walls, the three walls. We have a door frame. So let's put these on up. So we got the one there, the one there, the one here. And finally, let's put that door frame down. Alrighty, so looking good, looking good. We have a little house, but sadly there's no roof yet. There's no roof. So we'll be needing to do that. So let me just have a quick look what we need for the roof. It's called a wooden platform. So we need three plates and a wooden cross. So let me pick all these up here. When you have too much inventory, it does drop them. So to make a wooden cross, well, let me just tap out of there. Alrighty, to make a wooden cross, we just use these wooden supports. Use these wooden supports, which we made from the sticks, from the sticks, remember? So we need three of these, so one, two, three. Perfect. So we have our three wooden crosses there, and we need some plates. So we use the boards, which we made from the logs, to make the plates. Let's make three of those as well, and see if that's enough here. Three crosses and three plates, wooden platform. Alrighty, well, we only need one cross there, so I made a few too many, but oh well. So we got our platform now. Got our platform. So let's press two, and we can aim it on up place it on the roof but we can't we can't place it like this guys we can't do that we don't want to be doing that if we aim at the foundation on the bottom here it should line up correctly so let's put that down alrighty so all we're left to do is to build this door to build the door I believe you need some bolts and you need something else you need something else what do you need you need bolts and just uh, checking it out here bolts and a frame so we know how to make the frame it's back using these boards, so let's craft all these up, and then craft the plates into a wooden frame. But, sadly, we weren't able to find, we were not able to find any bolts in town. So, we're going to have to make those as well. So, we have a good campfire here, which we can use to cook food on. So, let's press tab, go to crafting, and click the fire button here. That should add fire to your tool. And then you can craft up all these, where are they, the stones. To get scrap metal. Alright, so we have some nine scrap metal here. And I do know that metal and fire make two bolts. So let's craft one of those. So we have two bolts ready to go. Let's take this fire off. Don't need it anymore. So we've crafted out two bolts out of the rocks we got from over there. Which we can get more um, stones, sorry, if we craft the rocks. So we can make some more stones, but we don't need those right now. 
So let's put our scrap metal, no, no, our scrap metal, sorry, our bolts in with that wooden frame, and we can create our door. Great. So we have a door here, but I kind of want no one else to enter my house. I only want it to be me that can open it. So we're going to continue and make a metal door. So we let's use three of these scrap metal here, just three, to make this metal door. So now, we, now only I can open it. Press, put it up in number two, press number two, and we can put this down. So let's line it up how we like it. And looking good, looking good. We have our house ready to go. We have our campfire for a bit of light, but I just noticed we don't have anything, anything to store anything with. So we, we kind of want to put our items away. So let's go run down here, cut down a few more trees, cut down a few more trees and we'll make some crates and some chests. The difference between crates and chests are that crates have four slots and chests have, I believe, six. And other people cannot enter your chests. So let's just finish cutting down this tree here and we'll run back over and I believe we should have enough wood to make our crates and our chests. Good stuff. Well, alrighty then. So we're back here. Let's get this created. Let's close the door and get this created. So we're going to need some more wooden plates, I believe. And we're going to need some crosses, some more crosses. Um, not plates, sorry. What are we going to need? Let me have a quick check over here. Storage units. We're going to need two frames and three crosses. So let's get all our logs we just cut down. Right, like the four there. Let's make them into boards. Then make them into the plates there. And then let's get the frames. Alrighty, so we have the frames now. Put the frames in, but we haven't got the crosses. So we have some supports down here. We're going to make some more crosses. Remember, we got the supports from the sticks. Alright, so we made the supports. Um, at the crosses, sorry, out of the supports. And we have the frames. So let's craft it up. We should get a crate. Awesome. So we have the crate now. We're probably going to need... Yep, so that's fine. So this crate here will store four items, but we don't want to crate. We don't want to crate. We want no one else to access our items. So we're going to put the crate back up into the crafting table with three more of the uh, wooden crosses, and that will create our chest. So let's craft that up. Awesome source. Alrighty. So we have our chest now, which we can put down and put all our valuable items in. So let's hold left click, put that down, and now we are sorted. Now we're sorted. We have our little storage chest here. We can put our bolts in. We can put our little scrap metal bits in. Control, right click to put all those down, by the way. So uh, if I want to put one down, two down, three down, or control, right click, we can put them all down. Alrighty, so there you will go, guys. The simple way and the fastest way to make a little area where you can store all your stuff. You can obviously make this as big as you want. Um, let me show you something quickly over the way just there let me get my um don't think i have them on me but yeah you can see our mega structure just slightly there we're just making on the server but yeah thanks for watching guys remember to jump down the bottom there subscribe follow all that good stuff also check me out on twitter and twitch tv thanks for watching